Yo, 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 welcome back to Metal Gear 2. I'm gonna try to finish the game today. Let's see how it goes. <laughs> Boom. We just rescued the Dr. Marv and Gustava died. Um, we've got the glider and crossed the bridge. And just reached this area. Oh, it's the same music. I don't even know. We reached this whole new area. So I'm guessing this is the last area of the game. We still have a while to go. But I'm gonna try to go from here to the end. Here we go. And for those asking, why are you blue? Because the night... Fucking hell. Right, let me actually... Ouch. Because the night vision in this game is blue. But in the first game, it was green. Hmm... So my options are that locker in the infirmary I was talking about. Is this a door? I can open this. Oh, I can open this. Oh, I thought I checked this yesterday. Did it work? Maybe I never, I never checked. It. Oh, is this a boss fight? Jungle evil. I've been waiting for you, Snake. I'm Jungle Evil, the undisputed master of the jungle ambush. Let's see wh whether you are a real snake or not. Oh, oh, okay, okay, okay. Interesting. So he's hiding under the grass. How do we kill this guy? We need to be smart. Let me see if there's any mines. No. Okay, okay. Interesting. What if I put mines around? And we s no. I wanna use the pistol. Where where is he going? Every time I hit him, he hides it again, so... This guy's getting destroyed? He went to the other screen. It's not worth it. But the grenades... Oh, the grenades do more damage, though. Ouch, 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 ouch. No, my strategy from the beginning was the best. Slower, but effective. It went up here again. Is it a healer or something? There you go. Oh, he's very low. Come on. One more, two more, maybe. It's back here. Oh. You're down, bro. You're down, bro. Oh, shit. Punch. Punch into death. Come on, he's so low. Ah, I need to heal. Oh, he went away. He's scared. Got him! Boom! Exploded. Oh, you heal when you kill him. All level 8. Okay. So with that, maybe we can open um, that that door on the, other, on the right side next to the lasers. And then we can crawl inside through a gap on the wall or something. Or maybe we have to dissolve the lasers. I have no idea. Let's go up here. Hello, hello, baby bell. How are you? <laughs> Welcome. I was watching yesterday, like, 
I look CSI. I think it's Miami or racial one liners. And it's so funny. So funny. Level eight. Oh, there's a door we can open here. It is a guard there. Oh, we are there. Good, good. How are you? I'm fantastic. Thank you for asking. Boom. Are we gonna open this? A surveillance camera. And a door there. Let's see if we can crawl like this. Stealth. Stealth. Come on, let me open this. Okay, okay. What is this room? Nice stealth. I, I should buy like no real night vision goggles because they're fucking expensive as shit. Or like paid ones to like I don't know, cosplay or something. Can I do anything here? I can't open this. Wait, wait, wait. Let me check. With the binoculars, you can check the rooms around you. Okay, like. Look. What is that? Is that an egg? <laughs> Looks like a, an, a giant egg. Wait, wait, lasers, lasers. Infrared goggles. Oh! Oh, go! An egg. Taken from the bio lab. Doesn't look edible. Its use is unknown. Welcome, Lung! Nice to see you. How are you? Giant ostrich egg. Thank you for telling me that. That word didn't come to my mind. I was literally what I was, I was thinking, but I didn't know how to say it. What is on the right side? Another egg. Okay. So now we have two eggs. They're the same. Same description, same everything. Why would we want an egg, though? Maybe Whisker wants it. I'll have your egg! Because the guard can see us. My egg is cracked? No! Wait! Bro! There's a fucking snake on my inventory from the egg. What the fuck? Okay, maybe if I take damage, it breaks? What? It broke. Oh, we're on a Pokemon! It's Togepi, but it's a snake! I wonder if you... That's... What is that for? Oh, we can open this now. Huh? Well, a bunch of kids. They keep the animals in a room northwest of here! I hear owls at night, it's so scary I can slip! You know what? At night they turn off the power so all the lasers' fences get turned off too! Then we get to play inside as long as the grown up don't don't catch us. So during night they turn off the the lasers. How do I make it to be night? I mean, we slow. Ah! Uh -huh. Just wait here. Maybe the animals expert knows something about the owls or the snakes. That's probably a type of boa. It's nocturnal and has a gentle disposition, but it's a snake, and snakes love to eat. It will eat about anything. I bet it will love to eat your rations. Better get rid of it quickly. Use A button to let it go. Wait, is it in my rations? When the snake reaches the egg shell, let it go. Over and out. Wait, what? Bro, she ate my fucking uh, rations. All of them. Bro, what? Bro, we had to get rid of the snake. Wow. So, what about the owl? Hmm. Poor snake. No. Ate my rations. Poor snake, me. Poor solid snake, yes. 
That's why they put so many rations here. So I'm gonna grab this one. It's falling asleep. He's hungry? I'm hungry too! I need my rations! They can go eat something else. Alright, let's take... Wait, what? Oh, it's getting late. Okay, this is when I was about to leave. So I'm guessing I just had to wait for a moment? There's a guard... Right there. Okay, we did it. I guess you just had to to wait some time. Cool share. I'll get this next something else, you know? Another kid. There is a lot of rats in the jail. They steal all kind of things and take them back to their nest. The grown-ups put out sulfuric acid to try and get rid of them. Okay. Oh shit! Holy fucking shit, that's scary. Door here. Okay, more rations, let's go. <laughs> scared me. So now is the night? Yes, because they turn off the... The lasers. Can I get past this thing? It goes too fast. It goes too fast. Did that do anything? Is that doing anything? I don't think it's doing anything. It's not showing any damage. No. And I don't think I have time to do it. Like, follow, 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 boom. I actually think I have time. But I'm pretty sure the door up there is not gonna be able to open. Ooh, the way back is gonna be harder, though. Jump scares, even in Metal Gear. Yeah. Okay, we're on this side. I should have explore. Okay, since we're here, I'm gonna keep going, but I should have explore. There's a solar coming. Beginning to believe. What is in here? An elevator. I don't want to go through here, though. I believe. I believe and I did it, guys. So, I'm going to try going down first. Yeah. From bottom town. B3. B3. Cole. It's me, your number one fan, Snake. Watch yourself. You have Dot Company, Night Fright, the last surviving member of the Whispers. Do you know the legendary Guerrilla unit? Night Fright. He's wearing a state-of-the-art camouflage unit suit that makes him practic practically invisible. 
Not only that, he will attack you with a gun that's a completely that's completely silent. No one has ever seen his face. You know what you have to do, right? Lucky me, I got a fun club. Use your ear, Snake. Over and out. Okay. Critical fight. Critical fight. Destroying this kid. I'm down, bro. I'm down to trade. I'm down to trade, bro. We're gaming, guys. We're gaming. <laughs> Yo, what's up, Rob? Every boss is like. Get his ass, I got his ass, good. Oh. Pretty cool boss fight, I guess. Invisible. And there's like different different uh, sounds. Nice gaming. If the game doesn't push you to get good, then I'll just use the easiest tactic. Will you blame me? Oh shit. I have to repeat the boss fight, don't I? That is so troll. You put an instant death right after a boss fight. Okay. I'm using the codec more too because codec helps. Situations like this. That they're not telling me shit. How to deal with sulfuric acid? Mm, let's see, you could neutralize it if you had something with caustic soda in it. I got it! You got any chocolate on you? That ought to do the trick. Sulfuric acid reacts with the sugar in chocolate to produce carbon and rubbery substance. Table sugar. See if you can find some chocolate. Over and out. Bro, Master Miller for the fucking win. I only have two though. That's why they give you so many. Okay, I need to go for more. Don't tell me this one takes two because it's bigger, please. Okay. What? I cannot open this door? Are you fucking kidding me right now? The doctor is there. Maybe I call them. The more you sweat, the less you bleed. The more tears you shed, the fewer game overs you'll get. Okay. I like how they constantly talking about like this is a video game oh I'm getting a call now you should be able to get car 9 from jungle evil don't you mean car 8? he only has car 8 no he was in charge of cars 8 and 9 he must have dropped it somewhere check the area he was in the car should be there keep up the good work
Because you manage your colic frequency right now. Are you telling me the car is invisible? Obviously, it's not visible. So where the fuck did he drop the car? And now- Why did they tell me that now? I lived this area twice, came back, and now he calls me. I guess you have to go to the other building. Oh, you wasted enough time? Now I'm gonna tell you. Wait. The boss in the jungle? I had to walk through the jungle and find the car because there were items laying around. I remember that. So maybe I have to look there. Oh my god. Oh my god. Wait, this was. <sighs> why, uh, why did they tell me this now? I was like. I thought we were talking about this boss. I don't remember each each boss name to be honest. It was like it dropped. Cause it, it, I don't know. I was just thinking it was the other boss, the quiet one. We have to search around here. Oh, that was not it. But I picked something. Makes sense now the way you're in the jungle. Yeah, I cannot see the car, right? Did I get it? Oh, level 9. We got it. Okay, okay, okay. Wow. I was in the jungle. And the car was between the, the grass. Okay, so let me check this again. It looks like the two doctors. Ah, Snake, you are too late. He's already passed away. His heart couldn't take it anymore. Mom! Wait, what's that bruise on his neck? Not to worry, Snake. Marv may be dead, but the plans for Oilex are safe. Zeus? Marv was a very careful man. He left behind a copy of the plans in case of emergency. He had a reputation as a video game enthusiast. He even used to have uh, the ship then shipped to him from the west every month. A few days ago, he had some microfilm in the circuit board of one of his game carriage. It was an MSX carriage made by a Japanese company called Konami. MSX? That's the world's best-selling brand of computer, isn't it? And then he hid the carriage inside the locker. Where is the key? I don't know, I couldn't get it out of him. I mean, he never told me. Get in a call. Snake, you're in danger! Holy, what's wrong? Snake, it's Matnar! I thought there was something strange about him, so I had the agency check him out. After he was rescued from Outer Heaven, apparently things didn't work well for him. His radical theories were rejected in the West. He was dismissed as a madman and shut out, shut out from the scientific community. And, and as time went on, he was forgotten. Matnar wasn't exactly happy with the scientific community, either. He must have been searching for some way to get back at them. That's when Sansibar Land talked to him talk him into becoming a double agent. He will use his status as a scientist to feed technological secrets from East and West to Sunsilver Land. Uh, Dr. Marv's disappearance? Right, the timing is too perfect. Madnar must have given them every detail of Marv's itinerary in the US. Madnar was after Oilix all along. That's why he wanted to go to America with Marv. Oh! I'm afraid you got me, Snake. 
I gave up everything to be part of your world, even the country I was born and raised in. But your world had nothing but contempt and abuse for me. I just wanted to finish Metal Gear. It is the culmination of all my life's work in robotology. But your politicians were only interested in nonsense like SDI, NEDW, and brain bombs. I passed on the scientific secrets of the East and the West to Sanstivarland. And in return, they aided me in my efforts to improve Metal Gear. Mother, did you kill Dr. Marv? Yes, he will not share the secret of Oilix with me. And it was I who caused Gustava's death on the bridge by contacting Fox on the sewer. Motherfucker! Madnar killed Gustava! The bathroom break. Snake, I know Marv. No, Gustava gave you the key to the locker. Give it to me. I breathe. What the fuck? Fuck, this guy is strangling me! Oh, what the fuck? Oh! I'm hitting him, though. Look, leave that fuck alone! Bro! I know you can't breathe, Snake. I'm trying to get rid of him. With the grenade. Come on, he's so close. I don't have more heals. He's now or never. Die! Oh, we got him. You motherfucker. Okay. So the same Dr. Madnar were rescued in Metal Gear 1. He was a devil agent all along. Okay, so this is the key. How do I change the shape? Because the sauna, the sauna was hot, and we change it there. Where is all our place? I can switch the shape of it. Think, guys, think. Think, guys. Something cold. Oh, we got in a call. 24? Oh, general. Gustavus brooch seems to be made of a memory alloy. Try changing the temperature of the brooch over and out. I already knew that. Thank you for the hint. <laughs> Miller the Philosopher. That's why they were not responding to my comic. Because one was dead and the other one was betraying me. So these are the lockers I was talking about because I saw this guy taking an item. So I'm guessing maybe... Mannequin's right arm. Nice. I'm guessing maybe we can use the brooch. Especially since the sound is so close, right? Oh, you need to be careful here, because the, the ground makes noise when you walk through it. And the guards will get a... Uh, will start looking for you. There's a camera, too. Okay. What is that noise? I don't know, bro. 
Oh, shit. Bro. Oh, shit. I don't like this. gaming guys okay we're fine enemies do come on this sauna so we need to be careful here too so equip this and it is changing shape already you see that on the bottom right. There you go. Now it's a key. So let's go back. Wait for the camera. Okay. We're doing it. Now we just need to see if... Uh... What the fuck? Are you fucking kidding me? The camera saw me. Saw my head popping out of there, I guess. Okay, let's hide here. The key's still the same shape. Didn't change. I'm gonna heal. Or rations. I can carry more now. Put the bucket on. Wait. I wanna test something. If you have the box. And the guard comes to you and you switch to the bucket, will it will it uh open? Oh! Oh this one opened. What is this? Cassette tape. What? The cassette tape found in Gustavas Locker contains a recording of San Silver Lands National Anthem. You can equip music! Woo! It's a mixtape for his sweetheart, huh? Oh, hello. <laughs> you didn't see me? What the f It's not changing. That can mean two different things. It's either the hot one for both, or the cold one is in a different place. Or is it here and takes longer? That's another option. Let me think, is there any other place that is like cold? Like super cold? It was a refrigerator next to the bathrooms. But was it was it like a fridge kind of thing? I found like two rations there. Because it's, it's not working here for sure. Okay. Is this a fridge? It's not. This blue kind of. Wait, wait, wait. Maybe it is actually. So there's like eyes on the sides. Oh, it's changing! Holy big brain. Okay, okay, we got it, we got it, we got it. Holy, that was not easy. Okay, so now we have to go back fast. What is the best way? Should I go to the kids on the swamp and use the box there? See where it takes me? Okay, we need to be fast on the swamp, though. Okay, here we go. I really hope it takes me somewhere close. What the fuck? 
Wait, what? Okay, not too bad. Not too bad. What? Yeah, there you go. We made it very fast. The key is still fine, right? Yes. Box. Yeah, let's see where this take us. I don't remember. I don't think I ever done this one. Building three. Straight up building three. Oh. That was quite a long ride, so. Even if it's two, we're just walking up again, so. Alright, that's fine. Because now I just we just have to walk one room. Two rooms up. That's it. And we are back to three. Can carry any more? Is it frozen? Maybe they need some time to unfreeze? Yo! They are frozen rations! So it kind of indicates you when the key will change the shape too, right? That is fucking amazing that you pick up a healing item that you cannot use it right away because you took it from a freezer. What? Okay, the key is still the same, but I don't think we have much time left. We have to keep going. That was the fastest way I could think of to get here. One track into another track. Okay, okay, okay. We got the key, we got the key! Let's go! This took me a while. First the acid, then the... The key level 9, and then the, this cold key. What is that? Rats. Finally use the mouse? I cannot stand up here. Oh! You one shot by the rats. What the hell? There has to be a trick there. Okay. Oh, now he's answering. Well, that sounds like the highly poisonous Zanzibar hamster. There are 1,183 different species of mice in the world. Hamsters are rodents, belonging to the mouse family. They grow to be about 25 to 30, 28 centimeters long and are found across northern Eurasia and Iraq. That variety was probably bred to be a house pet. House mice are very cautious creatures. They won't come out of their nest with humans around. Their favorite food is cheese. That's it, cheese. You can use cheese as bait. Do you have any on you? Too bad you're not here. I just ordered a pizza myself. Motherfucker. Cheese. Oh, this one has cheese. So... They're gonna come to me, though. But if they like cheese, and I have cheese on me... I don't know, man. Is there anything on the... Oh, they were coming out. They were coming out. Oh, they're coming, they're coming, they're coming, they're coming, they're coming. They're coming. No! Stop exiting, because if the key changes... 
This is it. This is it. This is how it is. Don't come to me. Do not. Do not. But I can use weapons there. But I can use weapons there. Okay, 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 okay. We're gonna fucking kill the rats. Kill the hamsters. So we attract them to the first room. And then we can use them for nades. And C4. <laughs> Okay, okay, okay. Are you guys ready? Check this out. Check this out. Look at this. C4. Boom. 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 <laughs> Boom. <laughs> ah, hell yeah, brother. Okay. No! Oh my god, I lost them all. Okay, should we fire now? There we go. Hello? Jeez. Are they scared? Do they know? Do they know? What if they know, guys? <laughs> the exterminator, yeah. Something sus outside. Wow. Okay, I remove everything. Are they coming now? Maybe I had to go first. For them to like smell it. And then come out here. Oh, they're, they're, they're coming, they're coming. DIE! Oh no! No! Don't touch me! No! I should have removed the fucking cheese from <laughs> I should have re remove it. Oh my god, he- she, The fucking hamster ate me. Hamster greater than snake. That was so funny. I did it on purpose for comedy. Yeah. Purposes. How shoot the fucking rat? I was like dodging. I, 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 it was dodging everything, bro. Alright. Here they come! Oh, that one's coming fast. This bad, this bad, this bad, this bad. Abort, abort! 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 I don't have the cheese on me anymore, bitches! This part of the game is really funny. Uh, fucking rats, bro. They're not easy to kill. Bro, I think Dr. Ma Matner is still alive. Like, he, he's... <laughs> okay. I think the best strat is to... To like, stand looking at the hole like this, and she shoot like this. There you go. Oh, 
one more. Don't be shy, Ratty! Don't be shy! I kill him. I got the rats. Courage. So... These are the plans for Metal Gear. The game Courage left behind by Dr. Kojima. I mean, Dr. Mark. The Oelix microfilm is ins hidden inside. Okay. The snake. The snake. He'll, he'll never let you get out. He will use it. He will use Metal Gear. I have one last gift for my daughter, Ellen. I'll tell you how to destroy it. To destroy the new Metal Gear? Try as I might, I could not reconcile East and West in my heart of hearts. But Ellen is different. Snake, you must do this for Ellen, the daughter I left behind. How do I destroy Metal Gear? The armor is thinnest on the legs. Use grenades on the legs. It is the only way. It sounds familiar. Oh! I knew it was still alive. <laughs> it's been there like half time for like an hour since I. <laughs> since I have been doing all the shit around. <laughs> oh shit. The final delusion of a senile old oh, man. There is no way to destroy this Metal Gear snake. Great Fox is back. Fox, where are you? Come and find out, snake. Go through the front door. I cannot use the binoculars here. Isn't it crazy that um, Great Fox helps you later? Oh shit. Prepare for battle, guys. Get ready for battle. Wait, we're gonna fight Metal Gear now? This is not the end of the game, right? Holy, they're giving us a lot of shit. They're giving us full inventory. We're stacked, though. We are stacked. Okay, here we go. Is this Metal Gear? On the legs. On the legs. On the legs. Oh! It's so much cooler than in the first game. It's more similar to Metal Gear Solid. One. Yeah, for sure. Snake, I'm not the same as I used to be, I'm, and n neither is Metal Gear. I'll show you what fear really is. Prepare to taste defeat. Oh shit. What the fuck? Whoa! Bro, the fucking blinking shit is so annoying. Losing health? I don't care getting hit. Destroy Metal Gear! Let's go! Woo! Oh shit! The courage is my snake! Burning hell! Oh, it took the... I'm burning! Everything's burning! What the... F oh, my, I'm still burning! We get in a coal! Yes? Snake, your items are on fire! Throw away all your weapons and equipment! Quickly, use, a, use the A button! Okay, okay, okay. Oh, 
Get rid of the fire. Okay, and now what? What the fuck? What do I do? Punch. Punch, punch. Punch! Throw! I don't have any more items so far. Ah. Easy piece first try. Yeah, but what do I do now? I got rid of my cards. Any help? <laughs> okay, nice. Because you know with the health health advice. What am I supposed to do, guys? I'm trying to punch the wall, maybe to break it. It's not working. I'm gonna die. Fuck it. Get rid of everything. Wait, I actually had to get rid of everything. Okay. Worm. The perfect ring for our final battle. It's been a while, Snake. Here we are, back in the minefield. What say we go at it hand to hand? A chicken fight? The two greatest rivals in Foxhound have been waiting for this moment for a long time. Fox, I'll beat some sense back into you. Snake, it's time for you to learn why they call me Fox. Who's calling me now? Oh, 93. Hassler, great Fox. Real name, Frank Jagger. Former member of Foxhound. He was the last man to hold the title of Fox in the Big Box era. Decorated five times. Yeah, I know all about how good he is. Better than anyone else. I fought with him. He's a cold blooded hunter. He never lets his prey escape. Everybody in the unit respected him. Look it up, look it up to him. That may be a snake, but do you know about his past? It might help you out. Ten years ago, we in the mercenary trade knew him as a as hunter. That was Jagger means in German. Why am I getting this call in the middle of a fight? What the fuck? Back then, he was involved with some woman from the Eastern Bloc. He tried to get her to come over the fence, but it all fell through. Apparently, the West wasn't interested in taking her. That's when Frank started to hate the politics. Politicos. What was the woman's name? She was an Olympic skater. Name was Gustava Hefner, real fine woman, movie star type. What? What? So, Grave Fox was the, the boat for Gustava when they talk about moving to the US and everything. Double identity. Good stuff, Hefner. Snake, if you manage to beat Bo Fox, I will tell everyone that Solid Snake is the greatest mercenary in the world. Over and out. I got this shit, bro. Uh, no heals for this fight, though. No heals for this fight. Oh fuck, there. There are mines around. Is he planting mines? Uh, if I stay on place, I lost so much health, though. I just have to not let him get close to me. So always cover the side he's walking to. And don't move. Oh, I see the mines. The mines are around. Okay, okay. I could take them maybe and plant them myself. I don't know. Punch him once. We're getting him low. We're getting him low, though. Yeah, as far as I don't walk through the borders, we're fine. Do you like that range? 
Great Fox. But playing this game is so rich for like uh, Metal Gear Solid 1. So much context for Miller. Oh, we got him! Solid Snake, Great Fox, and Miller Development. And General Campbell, I guess. Snake! Looks like it's finally time for me to give up the title of Fox. Fox, why? I'm not like you, Snake. My situation is more complicated. Big Fox might have been just another CEO to you, but he saved my life twice. This was way before he, I joined the unit. The first time, I was half white living in Vietnam. It was after the war, and half whites were being sent into forced labor camps. He saved me from that living hell, just like he saved all the children here. The second time was in Moz <coughs> Mozambique. I was being tortured as a Renamo soldier, and he saved me again. They cut off my ears and my nose. This is your idea of paying him back? No, you got it wrong. I hate war. It's like all the kids here, but I need it. War is all we know. We can make it in the normal world. We need the battlefield to survive. Big Boss gave us a place to fight. Conflict is in our blood. We can't deny it. I was born on the battlefield, and I will die on the battlefield. All I can do is fight, Snake. All I can do is fight. Making people happy, making a woman happy, is something I could never do. You mean? Guess I was always fate to die in action. Rest easy, Fox. I swear I won't turn out like you. Won't turn out like me? I'll have to remember that. Fight hard, Snake. Don't let your fans down. My fans? It was you, wasn't it? You were the boys on the radio. Number one fun was him. Probably payback for being so selfish. See you on the other side, Snake. You won't be alone, Frank. Gustava is waiting for you. Gustava. Thank you, Snake. <laughs> the fifth Grey Fox. And we got the courage back. If you think about it. Um if you think about it. Like, Gustava and Holy are like a prototype for Meryl. And Grey Fox is like a prototype for Raiden. Like, this whole speech of like, we are born in the battlefield, we have to fight a lot. That's the. I think it's literally the same sentence as in Metal Gear Solid 2. Isn't it? I'm not sure, but it sounds very similar. Over here, Snake! Who's this? Who's talking to me? Hello? Big Boss! You are alive? Snake, welcome to Sons of Love. I knew you'll come back to me. Holy epic. And to get rid of the nightmares I've been having for the past three years. The nightmares, they never go away, Snake. Once you have been on the battlefield, taste the acceleration, the tension, it all becomes part of you. Once you have awakened the warrior within, it never sleeps again. You crave ever big intentions, ever bigger thrills. As a mercenary, I'll think you will have realized that by now. You care nothing for power, or money, or even sex. The only thing that satisfies your craving is war. All I have done is give you a place for it. I have given you a reason to live. I never would have made you for such a hypocrite, big boss. You saw those children, didn't you? Everyone is a victim of a war somewhere of the world. And they will make fine soldiers in the next war. Start a war? Find its flames, create victims, then save them, train them, and feed them back onto the battlefield. It's a perfectly logical system. In this world of ours, conflict never ends, and neither does our purpose. Or reason, detra. So there is plenty of jobs opportunities. Is that what you're trying to say? On the battlefield, you and I are valuable commodities. 
but back home we're nothing but dead weight. If we're lucky, we might get the attention of some two-bit journalist from a cheap tabloid. You and I are doomed to remain here until we die like dogs on the battlefield. I've only got one fight left. To free myself from your grip. To rid myself of this nightmare, speak boss, I'll defeat you! It doesn't matter who wins here, our fight will continue. The loser will be liberated from the battlefield and the winner will remain. And the survivor will live out the rest of his days as a soldier. It doesn't have to be that way. I'm not like you. I love life. Very well, Snake. I'll release you from your suffering. As your former commander, I'll do you one last favor and put you out of your misery. I don't need any more favors from you. Really? And just how do you expect to beat me in your condition? With no weapons. Never give up. Fight until the end. Always believe you will succeed even when the odds are against you. Those are your words. Even I, even I make mistakes from time to time. Snake, this will be our final battle. Let's end this for one and for all! Holy. Okay. Oh shit. I kind of punch him. Time for oh, until the bottom of epic fight. It's crazy to think the background of Big Boss and Solid Snake, and that this is happening actually. You know, especially knowing the Big Boss from Metal Gear Th Solid Three. That's crazy. Oh wait 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 wait. Oh. Okay, 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 okay. It's coming around. Oof, that scared me. Ouch. Car six. I'm gonna heal once. Ah. Okay, 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 okay. We can do this. Has to be this one. I mean this one. No? Okay, okay, okay. Part two. Is that a lighter? I already opened this one, didn't I? Maybe not. It's like a puzzle boss. Level two here. Car three. Okay, we're doing it. I have one heal left, I think. Okay, R four. Lighter. Uses and no. Can I lead this up? Um. um. Okay. <clears throat> Holy shit, now we have to repeat the Alpine. I don't remember the order. That was so troll.
lot better this time. I don't think I can open this though. I need four or five for that one, I think. Careful here. Oh no, it's that one. Yeah. Okay, we got the lighter. Don't die now. Okay, a lot better this time. Okay. Here we go! I have two heals. And this is health. That's the thing, right? You cannot... Uh... Switch when you are using the flamethrower. Yeah, when you use your stack on that animation and he just fucking blasts you. Okay, so I'm gonna be more careful now. No. Only gonna shoot when he... Like that. Doesn't see me? I'm gonna heal. Oh my god, man. He's not low health and I have no more heals. This can go really bad for me. Okay. This is a really good spot, actually. Because he has to... Cr he has to do that across the screen. Yeah. Do we find the cheese? Do we find the cheese spot? Oh. He's learning. Okay. This is getting low. I don't wanna die again, man. Oh! It's moving. He's moving, he's learning! Oh shit! Yeah. Where is he going? Can we go back to... Okay. Intense 5. Oh, he's low! But if he gets he if he gets me like a ton of bullets, he kills me for sure. Okay. Come on! This is so clutch, so intense. Ah oh, shit! Oh no no, there should be. Oh, we got him! Woo! Snake! It's not over yet. It's not over. He's not over Jack. Snake. Defeat Big Boss in Metal Gear 2. Let's fucking go. Let's go. Freeze! It's okay, it's me, Snake. Oh. Holy. Did I scare you? Oh, what? It was a close one. So, what's going on? What are you doing here? You say it yourself, stay alive and we'll meet again sometime. So I did. Uh, that uniform was too tight in the chest. Uh, I feel much better now. Uh. All right, all right, I'm freeze. My snake is frozen. Very much melting, or that rather. Here, I stole this gun from the enemy, you can have it. Yeah, I can see how it'll be hard for a woman to use, thanks. 
So it's all over now, right, Snake? No, I still have one more job to do. You can't be serious. That's serious, Holly. Snake, no, you can't. <laughs> do you want me to call you a cat? Oh my god, that was funny. That wasn't funny, Snake. Oh, Grey Fox? This is Snake. I mean, Charlie. Pilot! This is Charlie. Go ahead, Snake. I got the courage. I'm ready to return to base. Making my way to the rendezvous point now. Roger that. I'll meet you there. Any passengers? Just one. Blonde. With a cute face. <laughs> Sounds like a dream. Over and out. <laughs> Anime moans intensifies. Holy! Oh, Holly. We got to run as fast as we can to the rendezvous points. Think you can keep up? Is that a proposition, Snake? I'll take that as a yes. Infinite ammo. Run! What is the random pool point? I'm kissing out here. Go, holy, go! <laughs> oh! What the hell is taking you so long? We're going to be here till Christmas! This is Charlie. I'm 10 kilometers from the rendezvous point. Hold tight a little bit longer. Over and out. Hurry. Ouch. Fucking bitches. I'm out shooting. Bro, 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 bro. Snake! Snake! Oh! The helicopter got him! Get to the chopper! Guys, get to the chopper! He's the chopper! We're saved! Charlie, you're late! Sorry, man. I didn't want to disturb you two lovebirds. I think we'll... I think we'll be home by Christmas. We'll be home in time for dinner, Snake. Let's go there. I'm looking forward to Christmas dinner. I'm sick of these rations. Ooh, we're going home uh, with Holly. <laughs> Is that GG? So, question, was that a re the real big boss? Because spoilers... He in Metal Gear Solid 4? No, yeah, 4. He and Solid Snake meet. Hideo Kojima. Thank you, Kojima. Oh, yeah, GG guys, GG's in the chat, let's fucking go. <laughs> this game was amazing. There were some puzzles that were that were very hard to find out, to be honest. Very confusing, but the gameplay, the areas, the new mechanics, 
the soundtrack was very cool. They tried to develop the characters a little bit more. In the first Metal Gear, and I was like, ah, no big deal, no big deal. It was it was like a a jerk, basically. It was like a, uh, it, it reminded me of like Scarface kind of. Ah, eh, it's okay, no big deal, yeah. And, but in this one, they they do a lot more dialogues, a lot more. They they, they dive a lot deeper into character motives, um, aspirations, and um, why they're doing what they're doing. Right, very cool. Especially with like Grey Fox and Snake. Um. <sighs> Thank you, Kojima. Yes. Yeah, this game was longer. And like I said, I, I'm not gonna mention them all, but so many new mechanics introduced in this one. Uh, what what score did I give the first Metal Gear? I think I give it like a five. Right. And this, if you play this game, in some ways you appreciate a lot more Metal Gear Solid 1, 2, and 3, and 4, and even 5, I would say. Every character. Every character. I think the, the, what elevates the, the Solid Saga, you can say, it's Ocelot. Like, Ocelot is amazing. And Otakon, too. Raiden, too. Yeah, well, I think Ocelot is probably the best character in the style, in my opinion. Solid Snake and Big Boss, or like Naked Snake, you can say. There too. Boss too. The mentor of uh, Naked Snake. Boss is an amazing character too. Um, but yeah, you can see, if you play this, you appreciate more, especially Solid, Metric Solid 1. Like this, a Metal Gear Solid One has a lot of uh, similarities. But Metal Gear Solid One, like the step from the first Metal Gear to this second Metal Gear is huge. But the step from this one to Solid One, like you can, like you appreciate. I was saying you appreciate it more and less. You appreciate it less. Because there is a lot of ideas copied over. Good work, Snake. Oh. The nightmares have stopped. I'm free. I'm a free man now. I see. That's too bad. By the way, about the courage. Is it really the one that Dr. Mar hid his plans in? Why don't we open it and find out? No need for that. The courage I brought back is Dr. Mar's. No question about it. Just put it in the MSX. All right. Here it goes. Huh? Nothing's happening. What on earth? Of course. Snake was right. There's no doubt about it. This is Dr. Muff's courage. What are you talking about? I don't see anything. Here, look closer. Dr. Muff left his signature on it. Right here, it says... I see it now. It's written backwards. This is going to do the world a lot of good. Dr. Muff's last performance. He really loved games, didn't he? From the bottom of his heart. Dr. Ma was entangled in a pointless political game and it cost him his life. But the king he left behind will save us all, right, Snake? Snake? Where'd he go, Colonel? Snake's gone! Snake? Where is he off to now? Snake! Snake! He promised to take out to dinner, me out to dinner. How long can. <laughs> Bro, the dialogue's a little too fast. I'm gonna read out loud. GG! Roy Cumbo. I tried to do the voices as similar as I could from Metal Gear Solid 1. Holy why? Like, Debbie Hater is one of the best voice actors and more, more easily recognizable from the whole industry. Why is this guy here? He appeared like two seconds at the end. <sighs> so, yeah, like I was saying. Um. Uh, they copied a lot of ideas from this game, but at the same time, they had new ideas, plus they developed even the characters a lot more. But it's Ma Master Miller is probably the most important character in this game if you want to play Metal Gear Solid 1. Like, 
Because in Met if you if you start playing Metal Gear from Metal Gear Solid 1, which is 90% of people who play the saga, or like 95, you're playing that and it's like, who is this guy? He's helping you, right? And then there's the twist. And it's like, oh, but now you know better. And if you play the game, I didn't want to do that. I, I wanted to I want to play the games from release order. But if you play the games chronological order. That's a whole new story. Metal Gear D. So chronological order will be three, five. Look at Solid Snake right there. Sheesh! Chronological order three. Oh, there we go. Complete Metal Gear 2. Jeez, guys, three hours. Okay, that was good. 8 hours and 30 minutes, 10 saves, 40 continues, 190 alerts, 500 kills, 30 rations, not special item. Call them deer. We're still being a deer. Let's fucking go. Um, have a good night, and I'll catch you next time with more Metal Gear. Bye-bye.